With Windows 8.1, I can customize the taskbar on my desktop and work efficiently across multiple monitors. I also have access to a powerful task manager that helps me use my programs and apps effectively. To begin, let me show you how I customize the taskbar to fit my preferences. I right-click the taskbar and then choose Properties. Here, I can automatically hide the taskbar to provide more workspace on my screen. I click Apply, and now the taskbar disappears, unless my mouse is hovering over it. I'll keep the previous setting for now, though. If I want more space to pin numerous programs on my taskbar, I can choose to use small taskbar buttons. For now, though, I'll use regular-sized buttons, and I click Apply again. With these other options, I can change the taskbar location on the screen, how buttons are combined on the taskbar, and what appears in the notification area. I can further customize the taskbar by clearing the Lock the Taskbar option and clicking Apply. Now, I notice that I can adjust the size of the notification area by simply dragging the slider. And I can even click and drag the taskbar to any side of the screen to help me work the way I want to. When I finish adjusting, I'll just lock the taskbar again and click Apply. To see a peak preview of my desktop, I select this option here and click Apply. Now, when I point to the far right edge of the taskbar, I see my desktop free of open programs. I use multiple monitors at work, and I can display my taskbar on all of them. When I click Apply, I notice the taskbar appears on my second monitor so I can quickly open pinned apps from any screen. I can also choose to only show taskbar buttons on the main monitor and on the second monitor if it has any open apps. Now I have a much cleaner and more efficient taskbar on my second monitor. And when I drag an open app to my second monitor, the app button appears on this taskbar to help me work the way I want to. With multiple monitors, I have more space to multitask and be more productive using all of the great features of Windows 8.1. In addition, I can create a seamless experience between both of my monitors by spanning the same background image across both screens. Let me show you how. I right-click the desktop and choose Personalize. I select the image I want. Then, from the Picture Position list, I choose Span. I save my changes and close the window. Now, both of my monitors are visually consistent. Another great feature is the ability to snap my documents and programs to the left and right sides of the screen for easy multitasking. I simply drag one window to the left until it snaps into place, and then I drag the other document or program to the right until it snaps into place. I can also use the keyboard to quickly snap the active window to different locations. For example, I press the Windows key plus the left arrow, or the up arrow, or the right arrow. When I want to manage my apps and monitor the efficiency of my device, I turn to Task Manager here. I can also access Task Manager by right-clicking the taskbar or by pressing and holding it and then selecting Task Manager. Or on my Start screen, I simply start typing Task Manager and I press Enter to open it. From Task Manager, I see a compact view of the apps and programs currently running on my device. To see more details about these apps, I click More Details. Here on the Processes tab, I see not only all of the open apps on my device, but also all of the background processes for each app, such as CPU power, memory, disk space, and network capacity. With Windows 8.1, I don't have to worry about background apps consuming valuable resources, because when I'm not using those apps, they stop using processing power, even though they're still open. For example, when I bring in an app that was open in the background, I notice that the CPU percentage increases only when the app is active. Also, the more power an app uses, the darker the color becomes to help me monitor and manage apps that are using a lot of resources. If I press and hold or right-click an open app from this list, I have options to end the task, open the file location, and even see the app properties. 
These other tabs show important information such as current device performance and the history of each app I've used. With Windows 8.1, I have many options for working on the desktop and accessing common tasks that help me get my work done faster.